Hello everybody. Welcome to another pickup video. Um, this is going to be a pretty quick one. And uh, I got a couple quick announcements before I go into the video games. <laughs> First of all, you might be noticing that we're listening to Sublime in this episode. Because, well... I wanted to listen to Sublime this morning, so I decided instead of putting video game music on in the background, I put some Sublime on in the background, so I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, the real first thing at, at order is uh, I wanted to uh, do a quick shout out basically to myself. Um, I have another channel that, that I just started, and it's for my Let's Plays, so if you guys are interested in watching Let's Plays, then uh, Go over to my other channel and check out my Let's Plays. I'll put up an annotation uh, right about there. So um, that's that's my uh, Let's Play channel, and I'm playing Kirby's Kirby's Adventure uh, for the NES blind, and I'm playing Crystalis for the NES. So uh, another thing I wanted to. Uh, mention real quick is my sister just got married and I went to her wedding um, the other day That's why I haven't made a video this weekend is because I've been out of town this whole weekend. So i um, pretty much just got back and uh, Yeah, so I'll put it I'll put that video up right here So if you want to watch that video, then you can go ahead and watch that video <clears throat> um, Let's just get right into the pickups then uh, I actually only found one yard sale this weekend, and uh, but it was a pretty damn good one, if I don't say so myself. So uh, let's let's just go. Uh, I'm not going to tell you the whole story of what happened. Basically, he wanted way too much for his games, and I talked him down to forty dollars for the whole thing. So I got nine games for forty bucks, and that kind of sounds like a lot, but it's really not. So. Uh, Star Fox Adventures for the GameCube. Sonic Mega Collection. It's all the uh, Sonic games for the Genesis. One, two, three, Sonic Knuckles, uh, 3D Blast, Dr. Robotnik's uh, Magic Bean Machine, or whatever it's called, and uh, Sonic Spinball. So, that was a pretty good find. We got Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. And I'm pretty sure this is a turn-based turn -based RPG. So, I'm not going to be playing this one. I'm probably going to be selling it or just keeping it for my collection just for, uh, just for looks or whatever. I usually don't do that, but it is a Mario game and... And it's a GameCube game, so I'm kind of tempted to just keep it. Anyways, here's a game that I do have already. Uh, Mario Sunshine, so that that's going to be going on eBay. Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker. And this is the second copy that I found, uh, I think, this month. So, or within a month, within, you know, 30 days. Uh, approximately I found two copies of the Wind Waker so it's not a rare game guys it's just it's out there you just gotta look for it you know look I got a copy right here you know I just found a copy a couple weeks ago and I just found a copy a couple days ago so it's not a rare game alright so but this is a rare game Fire Emblem Path of Radiance um, if the guy wasn't going to give me a deal and, and I was only going to walk away with a couple games, I was going to leave this behind because I had no idea how how rare this game was. But I was very happy to see that it was uh, that it goes for like forty to fifty, uh, sometimes even sixty bucks on eBay. So that's a pretty good one. Um, not sure if I'm going to keep it or sell it yet, but it'd be a good that'd be good that'd be some good money in my pocket, you know, for some more video games for some future videos. So I'll keep that in mind. So that was it for the GameCube games, and uh, there's a few more games here. We got Harvest Moon, Magical Melody. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or sell it, I just haven't decided yet. I think I might keep it for my daughter. Then we got Mario Kart Wii. 
And this is the game that I'm stuck on right now. It's a, uh, it's a lot harder than the other Mario Kart games. Um, I don't know if it's cheaper or it's just harder, but it seems like you get hit with a lot more blue shells and a lot more, you know, when you're in first place, they just hammer you with all kinds of stuff and all of a sudden you'll be in, you'll go from first place to 12th place within just two seconds. And it's usually right before the finish line too, so yeah. Um, I'm, on, I'm on 150 CC now, I already beat all the other uh, CCs. You know, I got gold on all the other races, so I'm doing 150cc now, and then I gotta do mirror. Anyways, you don't wanna know about that. Um, here's the last game, I guess you would call it uh, the cream of the crop, the grand finale. Um, Super Smash Brothers Brawl. And this is a video game that I've been trying to find for a while for cheap. You know, I didn't wanna spend the, uh, I didn't wanna spend the 35 or 40 bucks at GameStop for this game. So, all together, that was a really good deal. I got nine video games for 40 bucks. That's less than $5 a piece. And that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the sublime in the background and I hope you guys enjoyed the video or the video game pickups. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.